off. He's pulled off there. Just shows you where the pressure's off. These boys will pop them from anywhere on the table. Entertaining the crowd here. This is no disrespect to his opponent. He's just playing a bit of entertainment and where's he going with this one? in line from the, the cue ball or pot but of course he can't avoid the cannon on the black so he's uh, looking at an alternative that's one of the best alternatives I've ever seen really okay look with the cue balls finished but talking about a shot to nothing I mean what a pot but if he had a missed it look with the white mm. He can't come back up for the blue. Is he going to try and bring the black into play here? He certainly is. What a shot that is. One. That, for me, is one of the shots of the championship. That was superb. I don't see how he can bring reds into play here. You tend to concentrate more on just getting the pot and take your mind off the positional play. When you're full of confidence, it just comes naturally. This is a good effort, though. Oh, well, he deserves it. He deserves it. He didn't hit them with great pace, but he hit them absolutely perfect. Wow. All sorts. With that shot, it's a great pot. Didn't want to cannon that. He's left the pink on, but he's knocked the red safe. Oh. Well, I can't do much about that. John didn't seem to put his hand up and apologise. He may be thinking, uh, well, there's always a chance if he hits it right, he could knock it in. Best break will is in the game now. And look at this. You were talking about John 47. And don't the crowd love it. Just coming around to, to see if he can play the stun, the, the long double, but if we get in a good white at the same time, if he takes the pot on, we be can into the green and black. So he's played the long double, and it looks pretty good to me. Make sure you get the object ball safe. But he'll try and get this cue ball off the ball cushion, side cushion, in behind the black. I'll tell you what, it's a great line. It's a great line and it's a great length. What a shot! Did he get a double kiss on the pink there? One four point snooker needed for Ali Carter to tie, remember? Well, that's outrageous. One outrageous. What a pot that was. <laughs> Great shot. He's more or less forced into playing it because he only gets to the right hand side of the cue ball. I think Ronnie thought the frame was over when he hammered the black. He didn't think he would go off. He thought Barry would have conceded, but... Well, he will concede now after that shot. <coughs> Little wry smile on Barry's face there. He thought, well, he won't knock this in. 44. Purposely well, playing an exhibition shot here and have a look at this cue ball. Fifteen. He's gone for another trick shot. It's much easier to get there from the blue, but uh, well, 
well, he's gone round to where we had the circle. And he's just gone a little too far. He might just be okay. 28. Is he taking this yellow up the cushion? He'd be on the green. Mark knows if this goes in, well, he could win the frame, but what a tough shot. Oh, what a shot that is. 19. Well, what a pot, and now what a chance he's given himself. Well, he's looking to see if he can find an angle around missing the brown and the black to get to that red. And here it comes, he's found the gap. In fact, the cannon might work out. Well, have a look at that shot. What a shot he's Six. pulled out there. No easy, straightforward safety shot to get the white back down the table here. <laughs> I'll tell you what, well, if, if there's no easy safety shot on, there's nothing wrong with that choice. What a pot that was. See, there the two reds are absolutely smack in line. Now, if it's the, the red on the left-hand side, it'll make it what we call a reverse plant and you'll miss it. So it's one of those, you're going to have to play it hard and hope for the best. You need to hit it four ball. Yeah. Good chunks have left those planted, and you mentioned, sorry, don't put the two reds together, and he did put them together. 80. <laughs> Playing a little trick shot there, but Alan McManus, a very, very nice break of 87, and goes to play. That'll say that may please him greatly. Alan McManus has been a great player. At full stretch now, what a shot this would be. What a shot this would be. What a shot this is. Oh, my goodness. Phone the police. What a shot that is. Well, Robin sits there and he must be admiring that. The different circumstances of the Crucible. Can he do it now? Great shot. Absolutely great shot. Well played. Very positive and beautifully struck. One. Not many can play it like the success hasn't been that good. Only 50% from Ronnie and 100% from Barry so far. Oh. Oh. Good shot. Maybe nice kiss on the pink. One. 82. What about this for a shot? 88. Oh, absolutely. He's got a lot of fans in the audience here at the Crucible. Ken Doherty, a little trick shot to finish. It's been tight throughout. Look at how difficult that is. Brilliant killing. It really was. He's been so positive. And to take that on and get it was a terrific chance. Amazing. Where's this one going? Little exhibition shot there, and what a beautiful place that it was. That really. Five. There's always a possibility that you can pull that shot off, but I think he was. Sending it twice across that time. I'm too sure whether he's got a good angle on the pink to be able to kiss the black away and leave the red. If he hasn't, he can screw back off two cushions to get it to the red that's nearest his hand. That's the one he's played. Watch the cue ball. Wanted to go around the back of it, and he has gone around the back. Excellent shot. 14. Yeah. Well, this is why I call him Satnav Selby. I mean, look at that. Finding his way around the back of that red picture there. We'll know if the plant's in before Barry does. He's got it. He's got it. And this time Dennis got an angle on the colour. 